In the next few days, we'll talk about the laws of Cholam and the first one being the laws of wearing tefillin on Cholam You can look around, nobody is, no, no one is wearing tefillin here. If you go to different communities, you'll find that there is a machloket, there's a disagreement about whether to wear tefillin on Cholam Maran Shulchan Aruch rules that we don't wear tefillin, so you'll find in any Sephardic community, no one will be wearing tefillin. But amongst the Ashkenazim, there is a machloket, Rama and the Vilna Gaon. For the Rama, it is said to wear tefillin, but uh, the Vilna Gaon says not to wear tefillin. So what happened? In most of uh, the diaspora and Ashkenazic communities, most people wear tefillin. But in Eretz Yisrael, the first Ashkenazim to come to Eretz Yisrael were the Talmidim of the Gra. So if you go to Eretz Yisrael, in most communities you will find whether they're Ashkenazic or Sephardic, most are not wearing tefillin, no matter what, because they're following the, uh, the Talmidim of the Grat. Now, as things change and more and more people are coming to Eretz Yisrael, we're finding that even there are some Ashkenazim who are now wearing tefillin, even in Eretz Yisrael. But, as I said, the original minhag was both for Ashkenazim and Sephardim in Eretz Yisrael not to wear tefillin on Cholom Oed.